All right, I had a few questions for pediatric dosage calculations that I thought I'd work out. So I'm gonna do um, one of these at a time. Um, the first question says, uh, Tegridol, uh, the order is Tegridol, 50 milligrams, QID, PO for a nine-year-old who weighs 30 kilograms or 66 pounds. So let's get the important details here. We got uh, 50 milligrams, we got QID, and nine-year-old who's 66 pounds or 30 kilograms. Um, and this is for seizure uh, maintenance dose. Uh, the label uh, for the medication is 100 milligrams per 5 ml. And the question is, um, you know, uh, 50 milligrams of suspension four times a day. Um, how many milliliters would you give? Um, so 50 milliliters, like it says there. Um, and that's also the dosage range for a 6 to 12 year old. Uh, so the question is, is this a safe dose? Why or why not? And what is your action? Um, so because it already tells you that the dosage range is 50 milligrams uh, four times a day, and that's the order, 50 milligrams four times a day, so that automatically tells you um, that, uh, that, that's, that it's fine. Um, the uh, as far as calculating the dosage um, because it doesn't give you any uh, milligram per kilogram body weight um, you're just going to simply um, uh, you don't really have to take the account into weight because this is going to be age based um, and so all you need to do to calculate that uh, is to take the 50 milligrams so I'll write it up here and you're going to multiply by 5 ml over the 100 milligrams and that will give you your mls so that'll be there uh, so 55 50 times 5 is 250 divided by 100 if i'm not mistaken is 2.5 ml let me double check that right so the answer here would be 2.5 ml um, those of you've been following along you know that i like to do my math this way because then I can eliminate units and then I'm left with what I'm looking for. Okay, well I hope that was helpful.